हेलो स्टूडेंट्स माय नेम इज प्रोफेसर मोहम्मद आसिम एंड वी आर डूइंग एड मैथ एड मैथ फॉर आई जी सी एस ई स्टूडेंट्स विच हैव सिलेबस कोड जीरो सिक्स जीरो सिक्स एंड फॉर सी आई ई ओ लेवल स्टूडेंट्स विच हैव सिलेबस कोड फोर जीरो थ्री सेवन सो बोथ काइंड ऑफ स्टूडेंट्स कैन गेट इक्वल बेनिफिट फ्राम दिस कोर्स स्टूडेंट्स इन लास्ट लेक्चर वी डिड क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री फ्राम एक्सरसाइज फोर्टीन पॉइंट थ्री and the topic of this exercise is derivatives of trigonometric functions today we are going to do another interesting question question number 4 where trigonometric functions along with exponential functions together and we have to find the derivatives of these functions so before i start question number 4 first i would suggest all those students who are watching my lecture first time kindly go to my playlist there is a folder name is admath watch previous lectures of this exercise then you will have good command on this topic let's start part a question number 4 part a is e cos x so what is the derivative of e the derivative of e is e that is derivative of e cos x is e cos x but we have to multiply it by the derivative of cos x which is minus sin x so don't forget to write the derivative of the function that is the derivative of e power so minus sin x e minus sin x e power cos x is our final answer now come to part b part b is e power cos 5x Again, e power cos 5x derivative is e power cos 5x multiply by the derivative of cos 5x that is minus sin 5x multiply by the derivative of 5x that is 5. Hence, our final answer is minus 5 sin 5x e power. cos 5x this is the final answer of part b move to part c part c is e power 10x so e power 10x derivative is e power 10x but into derivative of 10x that is 10x derivative is sec square x so sec square x e power 10x is our final answer of part c now move to part d part d is e power sin x plus cos x e power sin x plus cos x derivative is e power sin x plus cos x multiply by the derivative of sin x plus cos x derivative of sin x is cos x and derivative of cos x is minus sin x hence our final answer is cos x Minus sine x multiplied by e power sine x plus cos x. This is our final answer. Hope you understand. Move to part e. Part e is e power x sine x. 
this time we have to use the product rule that is u into v formula here u is ex and v is sin x so u times derivative of v that is derivative of sin x derivative of sin x is cos x plus sin x derivative of u that is derivative of ex is ex take ex is common then sin x plus cos x is our final answer of part e move to part f part f is ex dot cos 1 upon 2x again we have to use u into v formula here u is ex and v is cos half x so u times derivative of cos half x that is minus sign half x dot derivative of half x is half plus cos half x derivative of ex that is ex now take 1 upon 2 ex common throughout the expression 1 upon 2 ex so the answer though the remaining part is what is left in the bracket minus sign half x plus cos half x Kindly wait. No, there is some mistake. What is the mistake? I am showing you. First, write minus one upon two sine half x ex plus cos half x ex if i take common 1 upon 2 and ex now see carefully ex outside 1 upon 2 outside the remaining is minus sign 1 upon 2x ex outside but here there is no half therefore we have to write over here 2 cos 1 upon 2x 2 cos 1 upon 2x in order to balance the overall expression now if you multiply 1 upon 2x into minus sign 1 upon 2x you will get minus half ex sin 1 upon 2x then you multiply half ex to 2 into cos 1 upon 2x 2 to cancel and you will get the uh, same expression cos 1 upon 2x ex so so hope you understand move to part g Part G is EX cos X plus sin X. Now apply U into V formula. U dot derivative of cos X that is minus sin X. Derivative of sin X cos X plus U V dot derivative of ex that is ex take ex common so minus sin x plus cos x plus cos x plus sin x 
साइन एक्स कैंसिल बाई साइन एक्स कॉस एक्स कॉस एक्स इज टू कॉस एक्स ई एक्स दिस इज आवर फाइनल आंसर ऑफ पार्ट जी वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग पार्ट मूव टू पार्ट एच पार्ट एच इज एक्स स्क्वायर ई कॉस एक्स अगेन वी हैव टू अप्लाई यू इन टू वी फॉर्मूला यू इज एक्स स्क्वायर डेरिवेटिव ऑफ ई कॉस एक्स दैट इज ई कॉस एक्स इन टू डेरिवेटिव ऑफ कॉस एक्स दैट इज माइनस साइन एक्स प्लस ई कॉस एक्स इन टू डेरिवेटिव ऑफ एक्स स्क्वायर विच इज टू एक्स ओके नाउ टेक ई x and x is common this is x square this is x so i am taking x common e cos x e cos x i am taking e cos x common what is remaining minus x sin x plus 2 this is our final answer of part h move to part i ln sin x derivative of ln is always 1 upon so 1 upon sin x into derivative of sin x is cos x cos x one za cos x upon sin x cos x upon sin x you know according to trigonometry ratio cot x so cot x is the answer of part i very easy part move to part j part j is x square ln cos x so we have to apply u into v formula u is uh, x square and v is ln cos x so x square dot ln cos x derivative is 1 upon cos x into derivative of cos x that is minus sin x plus ln cos x derivative of x square is 2x okay x square minus x square sin upon cos x is you know 10x plus 2x ln cos x taking x is common so minus x 10x plus 2 ln x is the final answer so hope you enjoy a lot this question move to part k part k is sin 3x upon e2x minus 1 this time we have to apply u upon v formula because two functions are divide each other so v square v as it is dot derivative of u sin 3x derivative is cos 3x into 3x derivative is 3 minus sin 3x dot derivative of e2x is e2x minus 1 dot derivative of 2x minus 1 that is 2 so these are the complete derivatives now it's a time to simplify taking e power 2x minus 1 common from the given expression so 3 3 cos 3x minus 2 
साइन थ्री एक्स अपॉन ई टू एक्स माइनस वन स्क्वायर ई टू एक्स माइनस वन कैंसिल बाय इट्स स्क्वायर सो द फाइनल आंसर इज थ्री कॉस थ्री एक्स माइनस टू साइन थ्री एक्स अपॉन ई पावर टू एक्स माइनस वन दिस इज द फाइनल आंसर ऑफ पार्ट के मूव टू पार्ट एल पार्ट एल इज एक्स साइन एक्स अपॉन ई एक्स दिस टाइम वी हैव टू अप्लाई यू अपॉन वी फॉर्मूला सो हेयर यू इज एक्स साइन एक्स एंड वी इज ई एक्स सो वी स्क्वायर वी एज इट इज डेरिवेटिव डेरिवेटिव ऑफ यू u is x sin x so u in in u function there are two functions are multiply x and sin x so for x and sin x we have to apply u into v that is product formula so u time derivative of sin x that is cos x plus v time derivative of x that is 1 minus x sin x dot derivative of uh, v that is ex derivative is ex taking x is e power x is common so x cos x plus sin x minus x sin x upon ex square This e x cancel by its square. What is remaining? X cos x plus sin x minus sin x upon e x. This is our final answer of part L. So hope you enjoy all parts of question number four. Very easy and very important. according to examination point of view so student this is our today's class where we did all parts of question number 4 what next only three questions 5 6 and 7 i promise i will do all these three questions in next lecture kindly do subscribe my channel and whenever you subscribe don't forget to press the bell icon button so that when i upload my videos you will get the notification kindly share my videos as many as you can good luck for next lecture